Hello world! The most fun thing I do on inline skates is to skate my local streets. So if you're looking to move on from the wrinkle practice area and head out into the city, here are five tips to get you started. For me, the most important thing to learn on your inline skates is how to stop. And if you want to roll the city streets, having a competent stop is vital. The type of stop you use is up to you, as long as you can perform it quickly and with confidence. Knowing how to stop will keep you safe and will make city skating a pleasurable experience. I've previously done a video on how to stop. If you'd like to see this, there'll be a link in the description. When we start out inline skating, we will naturally spend a lot of time looking at our feet. If you're going to roll the streets, you need to also learn to get your head up. Raising your head allows you to scan what is coming up, and you can look out for anything that might get in your way. Of course, there is always a balance between looking at what your feet are doing and looking where you're going, but as you become a better skater, you will automatically start to look more ahead of you. The scissor is simply positioning one foot slightly further forward than the other. This will give you a wider base and so will make you more stable. The scissor will make it easier to negotiate things like curbs, rough and uneven surfaces, and loose material like small stones. It is also helpful because if you catch your front foot, you can save yourself with your back foot. When out on the streets, you're going to encounter other people. Pedestrians tend to be unpredictable, so my advice is not to pass too close. If you have to, slow down and go around them. I know this can be annoying, but it's better than having an accident. When approaching others, a simple hand signal can be enough to let them know what you are doing. If you can, try to make eye contact with anybody you are approaching. This will enable you to pass safely, as you both know what you are doing. One of the most fun things you can do on your skates is to explore and discover new places. However, when you're just starting out, it's a good idea to stick with somewhere familiar. So, Perhaps choose somewhere you've walked or cycled before, or just head to your local neighbourhood shops, whatever is familiar to you. As your confidence grows with city skating, so will your desire to explore further afield. These five tips are of course just a few things to start you off, and are certainly not meant to be a definitive guide. If you have any questions or some good tips of your own, please leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching.